Hey guys, what's going on? This is Travis P11. I'd like to welcome you back to the channel. Uh, man, went out to my uh, local Walmart today. I thought I'd pick up a box of ammo because I'd like to take my 45 ACP out this weekend. And uh, lo and behold, most of the pistol ammunition is, is pretty much picked over pretty good. Um, so apparently, I guess, you know, Walmart's not going to be restocking that pistol ammunition. They're not going to be carrying any more handgun ammunition. Uh, I'm not saying that, you know, you should go out there and buy everything right now, but if you want to save money, if that's an option that you have, you might want to go out there and see if they got some of those more common calibers before they're gone. And, uh, I don't know if this ammunition that they're going to quit carrying, if they're going to get into like five, five, six and 300 blackout and stuff like that. But, uh, shells are looking pretty thin. I wasn't very happy about that. Um, you know, for a lot of us that live in rural areas, a lot of us that are law-abiding citizens, when it comes to buying ammunition, you've only got about four options. Uh, you can roll your own, okay? I can go to the local farm supply store and I can pick up ammo and I'm gonna pay about 25 to 30% more per box than what Walmart's gonna charge. Um, I can order in bulk online, which is what it looks like I'm gonna have to do now, or I can go make an 80 mile round trip to the sporting goods store. So if I need a single box of 44 mag or maybe a 38 special, and I used to always be able to get it at Walmart, it's gonna disappear. So uh, yeah, yeah, so apparently Walmart is giving in to certain policies to make themselves feel better because really in the end, uh, you know, suppressing the ability of the law-abiding citizen to defend themselves is not gonna help, is not gonna help the law-abiding citizen, it's not gonna help the customers. It might make you feel better Walmart at night, but uh, it isn't gonna fix the problem, just so you know, the problems go way deeper than selling ammunition to law-abiding citizens. So anyway, uh, pretty disappointing. Um, so now, you know, like I said, if I want that single box, I'm gonna have to go elsewhere. And uh, anyway, you know, for those of us that live in a rural area, we don't have a lot of choices. But uh, otherwise, that's it. So if you guys go out to your local Walmart and you don't find a lot of handgun ammunition on the shelves, just understand that the policy is going to be to not, uh, not, I don't know if they're going to restock. They might restock tonight. They're going to put out what they have and then it's going to disappear. So start looking into some online sales if you can. If you can't buy online, uh, man, I don't know what to tell you. You might want to start looking into reloading. So anyway, guys, that's it. I want you all to take care, have fun. And uh, guys, I want you all to be safe. Get out there and get your ammo. You might want to start stocking up if you got the local Walmart. Um, otherwise, I think that's about it, guys. I'll have fun. Be safe, and uh, we will talk to you soon, all right? Okay, take care. Bye-bye.